This is the beginning of the still life. And a very important start is to kind of pre-visualize in your mind what the image is going to look like. You're going to see a pumpkin. The pumpkin is under construction. Maybe one of the eyes is taken out and there's seeds pouring out of it. The crown is cut out. And who's doing the work? Who are the contractors? The eggs are the contractors. And they're going to have a scaffolding system around. Maybe not completely around, maybe even two levels. Okay? Eggs are going to be on the scaffolding. In the background, probably something very seasonal and scary. Maybe there's a glowing moon in the background and some old, uh, eerie, spooky trees. And the trees have maybe lost their leaves or they're just about ready to lose their leaves and they're, they're kind of hanging out in the background. Uh, maybe there's some lights from some scary looking buildings off in the background. You know, that's kind of the theme I have in my mind. Now as you can see, the stairs of my ladder, I don't want exactly perfect. I want them slightly off. As you can see, kind of off kilter a little bit. Once I built the ladders with these sticks, I thought, wow, you know, I could build the whole scaffolding system as well. I had plenty of sticks left. And it just seemed right. It just seemed like this is the kind of materials that the eggs would use to build their scaffolding. And the eggs know that they just need the scaffolding to hold together long enough to carve the pumpkin. Looking at my perspective, scaffolds are made. A couple things I need now. I need some planks to go down, you know, little walkways on the scaffold. Now here's our scaffolding outdoors. And the reason they're outdoors is because I'm spraying on a, a, uh, a stain and sealer. Now these are just paint stirrers. I got these at the store and this is going to be used to, uh, to use as my runners, you know, along the walkway, along the scaffolding. It's great to be able to find props like this. You can go to a paint store and get them for free. Okay, the scaffolding is finished and complete. I like the way they came out. I think it'll be very safe for the eggs. So that's all happening.
We have one light coming over on the right hand side here, cascading over the pumpkin. We have another light on the left, coming from the side. We have a nice blue gel in the background. And these lights coming from these cardboard cut out little houses. Here is the finished product. 